Here's a tube we're going to be testing. It's a lightweight charge tube. This one fits the Marauder air rifle and it's by Jefferson State Air Rifles. It's high strength aluminum. Beautiful job. Nice black anodize. All the milling done for the same as OEM Marauder. Thing about this tube is that it is one and a half pounds lighter than the standard Marauder tube. That's a pound and a half weight you can take off your Marauder rifle. We're all set up, ready to start the test on this lightweight Marauder charge tube. Got it filled with hydraulic oil. It's all primed and purged. Hydraulic pump over here goes up to about 8,000 psi. Into a manifold here, we've got a, a two-stage two system. Low pressure side here, which will take the 8,000 psi and bump it up to about five times that. So this is a pressure multiplier. This gauge right here goes to 10,000 psi for the low pressure side. On the high pressure side, gauge goes to 30,000 psi. That's 30,000 psi, 5,000 psi increments. And it's going right into the tube. Tube is filled with hydraulic oil and all the air is out of it, I hope. Uh, all right, we're all set up purged and primed. I've got a little bit of pressure on it right now. First thing we're going to do is just pressurize it from the hand hydraulic pump. Uh, take that up to maybe 5,000 psi or something before switching over to the multiplier. We're at about 6,500 Take an increase it a little bit up to about 9,000. Let's see what happens. Okay, we're getting up close, so we're up at about 9,000 psi now. So it looks like we just had an O-ring failure. So the tube is still fine. I'm going to measure it in a minute. But uh, tube's still fine. We had an O-ring failure.